Oh, hey, you just caught me playing my Nintendo Switch Lite with Bluetooth headphones. How do I do it? Let's find out. Both the Nintendo Switch and the Switch Lite do have three and a half millimeter headphone ports on them to plug in any type of headphones you want. But what if you want to go wireless headphones? What if you want to use Bluetooth? In my case, I'm using Apple AirPods. This is all made possible by a sleek little device that I call the Route Air from a company called Gully Kit. Gully, Julie Kit? Gully Julie Kit. It's nice to meet you, <laughs> Mrs. Julia. Gul. Gully Kit. Gully Kit. This version is the Route Air Color. It is a nice little Pokeball color, uh, red and white with the black in the middle. The top is just a small little cap. And then inside you have a USB C. You also have two little buttons. This thing, this little device, will pair up to two different sets of Bluetooth headphones at the same time. So if you and someone else are playing, let's say you're on an airplane, then both of you can have Bluetooth headsets synced to this and hear the music on the switch. The Route Air does come with this nice little carrying case, foam padded plastic case, good to throw in your bag. It's super small. There is a bigger version of this, but this is the Route Air, which means that it works with the Nintendo Switch Lite. It also works with the PS4 and the regular Nintendo Switch. Uh, it just plugs in the bottom here on the uh, USB-C port and you will see the little lights start flashing. To pair this, all you do is put your Bluetooth headphones in pairing mode. In my case, you just flip open the top on your AirPods, hold this button down for a few seconds and it will auto pair. It's super quick, super simple and the audio is outstanding. This does work with Bluetooth 5.0 and below so you don't have to worry about what type of headphones you have, it should work. Also in the case, you get a handy little right angle USB-C to USB-A adapter. What's this for? If you're playing your old school Switch on your dock, all you do is plug this adapter into the side like so, and then you take your adapter out of your Switch, USB-C to USB-C, and now you have Bluetooth audio coming from your dock. It's out of the way, it's in the back, unobtrusive, so then when you take your switch and plug it into the dock, you have Bluetooth audio. How perfect is that? Being that the switch and the switch light are both very portable devices, it's great to have an option for Bluetooth audio, whether that be AirPods or any other Bluetooth headset that you have. This is great because I can also sync these to my phone and to the route air so I can take phone calls or get alerts, anything like that on my phone. Also while I'm enjoying the crisp clear audio from my Nintendo Switch. When you're done with this, you just snap the cap back on, throw that in a case, and you're good to go. The Route Air does support APTX for very low latency if your headphones support them. The AirPods do not, but there is little to no latency at all using this device. When you do get this plugged in and paired up, uh, the lights on the bottom will tell you which channel A or B is paired and also which mode you're in, whether that's ATPX, SBC, or LL. I can't recommend this enough. As much as I play my Switch, uh, not at a desk, usually down on the couch in the mornings, this is a fantastic piece of hardware. Also, something this cool is also highly affordable. Uh, these are not expensive. I did say there is another version that is larger and that is for the original Nintendo Switch. However, this works with both, so you don't have to grab both of these. This one's a lot smaller. There are other types of Bluetooth devices for the Nintendo Switch that plug into the bottom the same way, but most of those hang down really far and keep you from standing your Switch up on the desk. The great thing about this is once this is plugged in, it's out of the way, and if you're using the Satisfy Switch Grip Lite, like I am, it doesn't get in the way of the stand-up feature of the Switch Grip Lite. I did say this works with Bluetooth headphones, but anything Bluetooth will work as well. If you have an external Bluetooth speaker you want to sync this up to, it works just as well. Put that in pairing mode, hold down the pairing button on either channel A or B on the Route Air, let it sync, and you've got fantastic, beautiful, crisp audio on the go, wherever you need to go. And I will put a link to the 
route air from Ghoulie kit down below if you want to pick that up from Amazon. That would be fantastic and help the channel out. Thank you all for hanging out. I appreciate you all. If you like this video, think about subscribing so you can be the first to be notified whenever new content drops. If there's anything you want to see reviewed, or anything you're curious about, please let me know and I will put something together for you. Thanks again. Love you all. Peace.